fans of Gboard, I've got an update for you to check out. There's finally a way to remove the comma key or the period key, or both. Since many of you invoke the period by pressing the space bar twice, this can go a long way to giving your on-screen keyboard a cleaner and more minimalistic look. Let me show you how it works. These new options have been added to version 16 of the Gboard application, so be sure that you have installed that version or later, and then dive into the settings area by tapping on that gear icon right here. From here, we're going to tap into the preferences menu, and once you have installed this update, you'll see two toggles here, one for the comma key and one for the period key. So if you only want to remove the period key, disable that from here. Back out of the settings area, and you'll see you still have access to the comma right there. Or you can choose to disable both the comma and the period keys. However you use your smartphone keyboard, Gboard now has a way to help you customize the keys that it uses. That way, you can set it up with a very minimalist layout if you really want.